Hey there, it's Laria. I hadn't planned on making a UI part 3 video, but a few of you asked me about importing profiles and which add-on client I'll be using now that the Twitch client will no longer support add-on management. In this video, I'll go over the new add-on client I'm planning on using and the reasons why, and then I'll show you how to import profiles in a few different add-ons. In my first UI video, I went over my own must-haves for a healer UI, including raid frames, mouse overs, weak auras, plater, and exorcis raid tools. In part 2, I went over specifics about setting up raid frames and raid cooldowns using Exorcist raid tools. If you're interested in watching these videos, I'll link them in the description. Now I want to jump right into WowUp, the new add-on updater client I'll be using. Earlier this year, we found out that Twitch sold its add-on updater to a new company called Overwolf. If you've been thinking about switching to a new add-on updater, now is a great time to do so. WowUp is really similar to the Twitch client that I'm sure most of us have been using, but I've found that WowUp is much more straightforward and easier to use than the Twitch client. This is WowUp's GitHub page, and you can see that the developer wanted to create something that the community can believe in. It's clear that this add-on client is being managed with the players in mind. You can also see that it offers a lot of different features, many that were included in the Twitch client, but again, WowUp is much more concentrated on just providing features for managing and updating add-ons. This video isn't a deep dive into WowUp or its features, but I want you to see what the client looks like. As I said before, it's incredibly easy to use and should be familiar to anyone who has used add-on updaters before. This first page shows you the add-ons you have installed and then lets you know if any of them need to be updated. You can also choose to update all by clicking the button at the top. There's also a section where you can search for other add-ons to download. One of my favorite things about WowUp is that you can update LVY with it. Previously, you either had to update LVI manually through their website, or by using the LVI client updater, which is a completely separate add-on than this. Now, with WowUp, you can update LVI just like any other add-on. In my last few UI videos, I go through some of the add-ons and profiles I use. I've shared these profiles and weak auras on Wago. This part of the video will show you how to import these profiles into your add-ons in-game. For example, if you visit my Wago page and decide you want the Plater profile I use, just click on the name and the import string should pop up. Instead of highlighting the entire string yourself, you can just click on this button at the top that says copy plater import string. Then when you're in game, open up plater by typing slash plater. My mouse has a red circle around it, so watch it go up to this profiles tab at the top. Then on the left side, you'll see that a few new buttons appeared. Click on import profile. The empty text box that shows up is where you'll paste the import string you just copied from Wago. Just a warning though, Plater seems to take a bit of time to import, at least for me. It took about 30 to 45 seconds for it to fully import. If yours is taking a while, just wait a minute or so and it should finish loading. To change the Plater profile you're using, go back over to the left side and click on Open Profile Settings. You can switch out the Plater profiles you want to use with the existing profiles drop-down list. The next add-on I'll go over is LVY. Type slash EC to open up the customization window. Then on the left side, all the way down at the bottom, click on Profiles. Before I ever import a new profile or change my profile on a new character, I always, always make a new profile. You can name it anything you want. In this case, I'm calling mine Video Test. Now you can see that my UI completely changed to the standard one that comes with LVY. But what we're doing here is importing a new profile. So now that we have made a new profile, click on Import Profile at the top of the window. A similar text box as before will appear. Just paste the new profile string in this box and click Import Now. I hope this video has given you some good information about WowUp and add-on clients, and how to import profiles for some of your add-ons. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions.